Would you like would you like a fluff fruit? Okay. See, we're giving them fluff fruit this time, guys. We're not murdering anybody with a fluff fruit. I I feel like I just stepped on something. Oh, what the hell was that? Hi, I'm Echo and welcome back to the new Pokemon Snap. Now I know the audio sounds different. Long story short, my laptop broke and it is what it is. We have to deal with it. But anyway, on to this game. I actually did a bunch of grinding while you guys were away. So now we have access to other islands. We have the access to the... I actually didn't see the names. The Voluca Island, which is a bunch of sandstorms and oasis, and as well as the Maricopia Blushing Beach. So it's an option between these two, it's a fork in the road, and you might be curious on what happened during that grind, so future Echo, please edit in a bunch of really good shots and make me look really awesome. Hey, get over here you gorilla bastard. Oh Jesus. Yes, yes, it's a flag. Okay, it's a flag sire, father and son. Yes. So yeah, basically we had diamonds all around, and therefore it led us to this point. Now I'm not sure what I want to explore first. If it's sands or if it's beach, maybe, maybe. You know what, let's go top to bottom. So we'll go for the sands. Before I start this off, I want to remind and well, I can't talk. I want to remind everyone to like, share, comment, and subscribe to really help the channel grow. And yeah, if you've already done that, then we can start this sweltering sands adventure. And here we go. I I only see sand. I don't know what we're in for. Probably a lot of ground types. Immediately, I see Skarupi and I, I see Mandibuzz as well. Skarupi! Oh! He, he dug in. I see a Heliolisk in the distance. That looks kinda cool. I, I'm already getting analysis. What do I need to analyze? Is it you? Oh wait, no, it's you on the far end. I, I, I see it. Some tracks left by small Pokemon. That's... We have... Cacnea. Awesome. Cacnea. Would you like my fluff brood, Cacnea? Ooh. Oh, you roll. I'm not hating. I'm not hating. Come on. He Heliolis is over there still. I realize that I'm not using the Illumina effect right now. But that's fine. Oh, I see a Sk Skarupi in the sandstorm. Where are you, Skarupi? I, I lost it. Oh, you're over there now. There's so many things going on, I can't keep up. Where am I analyzing? What are you? Are you the Crystal Bloom? You are the Crystal Bloom of this area. It's so loud. And and the tornado. This feels very precarious and unsafe for a child to be in. I don't know why I'm the one being sent out to the desert. Hello? I, I saw your shadow, but I didn't see you. I'm so sorry. Oh. Okay. All right, Mandy Buzz. Okay. That was very sassy circling that sandstorm. Oh, okay. I, I totally missed that. Hippowdon. Not gonna lie, Hippowdon's one of my favorite Pokemon. Also, I, I I forgot the showcase, but in our last woo, good shot of a Hippowdon right there. Would you like a fluff fruit? Fluff fruit. I I know Torchic is there. Fluff fruit. Torchic. Torchic. Would you like my fluff fruit? Oh, really? Okay. Uh, where was I? Where was I? I was supposed to talk about something. Ah, uh, yeah. I have this little ice cream machine thing. I'm not gonna use it too much because it gets annoying. But also, we have the Illumina effect, the, the Illumina orbs now, so that we can make sure that Pokemon glow. But I think it's better off for nighttime photo shoots. I think, anyway. Gotta make sure we turn around so we don't miss anything. Hippowdon right there in the center. Good shot, good shot. Ah, I love, I love all these Pokemon. Heliolisk right there. Wake up. This is what the ice cream maker's for. 
Wake up! Wake up! Ice cream! Ice cream! Okay, fine. It won't. Hello, analysis. To the right. Oh! Oh, wait! Why am I going down so fast? Oh, that's so douchey. Why'd I slide down the sand? Hello? Okay, there are sandstorm Vivalon as well. This is looking like the end of the path. Hey, Paladon. Is there a special interaction between you? Oh, are you about to fight? Would you like a fluff fruit instead? Instead of fighting. More analysis. Why is there more analysis? Hello? What are you? Something's buried in the sand. Would you like a fluff fruit? Mysterious buried creature. Don't look at me angry like that. Oh! He ate my fluff fruit! I didn't even catch it, but he, but he ate my fluff fruit. He did. And this is about the end of the course, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. That wasn't... That wasn't our best run. It was something. Damn it. Okay. Okay. Fine. It was something. It wasn't our best run, but it was something. We. Hello, Professor Mirror. Do I have some Whoa. photos for you? Welcome back. Yeah, a bunch of new Pokemon. Six. We only had six Pokemon. That whole thing. That's that feels wrong. All right, these are all the photos that we can show Professor at the moment. Let's see the score. Come on, Professor, give me something high. I did really good in the sands, even though there wasn't a lot of Pokemon. Skaroopy, great photo. You've never seen a Skaroopy bouncing out from the ground like that. It's kind of centered, kind of big. Oh, why is the pose low, though? I feel like that's a pretty good pose, Professor. Bronze, okay. Way to embarrass me off the bat, that's fine. It's, it wasn't it wasn't a flying type. That's the reason. Heliolus, Heliolus, pretty good photo, pretty centered. Really shows that it's a desert Pokemon. Gold. You know what? I'll take it. I'll take it for the Heliolus. What else do we have? Cacnea. See, a shot of Cacnea upside down, mid roll. Give it to me, Professor. Three stars. Give me diamond. That's not diamond. That's bronze. Moving on. Forget about that photo. It was never taken. Vivalon. This is not a better Vivalon nice pick. One. It's farther away. And honestly, I don't think it's as pretty as the other variation. Yeah, exactly. Mm. Mandibuzz. This is a flying type. And it's my flying type pride on the line, Professor. You've got to give me diamond. Nice work. Professor. Professor. I swear to God, Professor. Okay. Let's see Hippowdon. This beautiful photo. Magnificent photo if a Hippowdon, if I've ever seen one. We should we should have a good one for this one, yeah? Come on, Professor. Gold. Yeah. Yeah. I, I expected gold. It wasn't a diamond shot. A diamond shot is a lot closer. It's a lot bigger. And it's a lot more dynamic. But it was... It was gold, so uh, you know I'll take it. You're not gonna level me up, are you? Mm-hmm. Mm-mm. He said, mm-mm. Our research paper in this spot is just getting started. I'm sure you're more than up to the task. Ugh. Desert research team. Thank you. You know what? Since we, ha we're, we have to level up anyway, let's try it again, baby! We need to be less frazzled, and we need to use our resources as wittingly as we can. We need to use the fluff fruit correctly. We need to use the ice cream machine correctly. We need to have Illumina orbs in play as well. Immediately off the bat. Okay, fine. I say immediately off the bat, and immediately off the bat, the Pokemon escapes my grasp. Hello? Oh, it's you again. I already analyzed you. Mandibuzz in the air. Is there anything behind me? I need to remember that I can look behind me. But I don't think that's particularly useful in this case. 
Come on, Heliodis. You know you want it. I I really need to stop throwing two fruit at the same time. Oh, you do do you do do a dance dance. All right, all right. Good photos. You. The Skorupi in the air. What do you need? What do you need? I already analyzed you. Ugh. That's not good at all. This is not good at all. There's so many mandibuses just flying in the air. Come on. Yes. Give me more. Attitude. Ice cream maker. I, I, I know you're sick of that tone already. I know. Believe me. I'm sick of that tune already. I have no choice. It's the tools the Pokemon professor gave me. If, if I have to work with an ice cream maker, I will work with an ice cream... I, I keep forgetting that it's gonna spook me like that. What is that? Oh, okay. That's still Cacnea. I, I was about to say, is there a Pokemon out in the distance that I was completely ignoring? Uh-huh. Torchic. Come on, Torchic. That's right. Walk towards the top fruit. There we go. It burned the fluff fruit before it ate it. Are you is anyone gonna dance? Hmm. Okay, fine. Oh, there's a lichen rock over there on the other on the other side. I see. I see. There's a lichen rock on the other side. Noted. Are you gonna do dancey dancer? No. Will you at least eat? No. Okay. Oh! You you double touched me, you bastard! Who roared? Who? Was it you? Yeah, you were giving me all the action and I was not paying attention. Oh. It's you. I know it's you this time. Wind Erosion has since become a Pokemon's den. Which Pokemon? Mm, I'm not satisfied with this run either. There's so few Pokemon in the desert. It's not fair. I should have went for the beach. Oh, it's sleeping. Ice Cream Maker. No. Okay. Fluff Brood. Love fruit. Okay. Bye then. Come on. Yes. Closer. It's time. Good shots of Hippow done. Good shots of Hippow done. Oh, that was a wonderful Vibillon shot. I'm satisfied. I feel like we have enough to level up now because of that. There's a pincer in the ground. Wake up! Fluff fruit! Oh! Oh! A wonderful pincer shot as well! Right on the end there! Nice! Ah, that's so satisfying. Ugh. I, I should get a like just for that shot. I should get a like. Come on, Professor Mirror. I actually have good photos for you this time. Yeah! Eight Pokemon photograph. Amazing, right? I found two more. I'm excited. Alright, time to show the professor. Professor, I'm excited for you to see the last few photos. Come on. Mandibuzz, this is a lot closer, a lot fiercer. You see the sky. This should be Diamond now. Yes? Yes! There we go. I've regained my honor as a flying type photographer. Keeping that one. Amazing photo. Amazing photo of Amanda Buzz. Heliolist, this one's kind of closer. I think he was mid dancey dance. Oh, pose is definitely way off. Err. I'm still keeping this one. Whichever one's higher, I'm keeping. This one, four star Scorpy photo, but it, honestly, it's not really that good. This is bronze, probably. Yeah. Yeah, it wasn't that good. But I know what they want me to do. I, I understand what they want me to do with that one. Torchic. This is actually really good. 
because it shows that Torchic burns its food before it eats it. Which is really good for the whole like purpose of the Lentil region and this whole Pokemon expedition in the first place. Because we're trying to understand the relationship of the Torchic to its environment. Why was that gold, you disrespectful professor? Hey, Paudon. I just went for the one star just for the extra points. This is all big, nice, and close up. Yes? Yes. Bunch of golds for Hippowdon. Nothing too big. Lycan Rock. I didn't notice the Lycan Rock at the end. I didn't even notice the female Hippowdon over there. Nice work. I'm, I'm sorry, I rushed through that. Silver, it's just not that interesting. Now, this one. Smack dab in the middle. Big sandstorm pattern. Nice Give it to me, Professor. It's a good Bivalon. It's my diamond Bivalon. It's my diamond Bivalon. Awesome. Awesome shot. And now, my pincer. My three star jumping in the air from the desert pincer. Smack dab in the middle. Dramatic entrance. You're right, Professor. Per perfect timing. Diamond. Diamond. All the diamond. Let's go. We are a good pincer photographer. One star diamond, two star diamond, three star diamond. We got it. We got it. What do you think, Professor? Is that enough for a night expedition in the desert? It is enough, right? Come on. Come on. Oh. Oh. That's a weird noise. Look at that! You've hit a new stage in your research. Keep an eye out for changes, no matter how small. By the way, thanks to the progress you've made in your research, I've got something to report. I'll fill you in once you're done squaring away photos. Let's go! Night mode, baby! Night mode! Hello, Hello Professor there. Mirror. Looks like you've gotten some great research done in the desert. now. I suppose it's time to take the next step and have you go there at night. Yes! You mind? Once you photograph the Illumina phenomenon in action, I can make Illumina orbs for that island. See? Thank you. That's great. That's great. Let's just jump right into it. I'm excited. Volaka Island, Sweltering Sands, night. Let's jump right in. Ooh, it looks so peaceful. Like Arabian Nights and Arabian Moons. I, I see trap inches already. The stars breathtaking, definitely. Oh. I suppose the sky is clear at night and during the day. All right. A bunch of trap inches. Come on, both of you. Oh. Nice. Nice. Good three trapping shots. Okay, they're they're waddling away. Cacnea. No! Derpy running Cacnea, please. Awesome. Nice. Nice. Why'd you stop? Would you like would you like a fluff fruit? Okay. See, we're giving them fluff fruit this time, guys. We're not murdering anybody with a fluff fruit. I I feel like I just stepped on something. Oh, what the hell was that? Fluff fruit. What the hell was that? Crystal bloom. Oh, we're looking for a crystal bloom that's in Illumina effect so that we can get Illumina orbs for this area. What the hell was that meteor strike? I don't see Pokemon in the air anymore. I think all the Mandy buzzes are asleep, probably. Mm -mm. Up the hill. I'm ready. Ah, we got a Lycan Rock. Midnight form. Oh! Oh! Are they fighting? Oh, really? Please no. Please not at me. Oh, I'm I'm going right. 
I'm going right this time. Why am I going right? Okay, Mandy Buzz. Okay, I don't need your attitude. Fluff brood. Okay, I made it mad. I made it mad. Oh, trap inch. Can I throw a fluff brood right in the mouth? Oh! Sorry, trap inch. Sorry. Oh, hi, Lycan Raw. Fluff fruit. I, I need to stop throwing it so far away because, yeah, these back shots are not it. Why is this all green and glowy? Are there more Morlulls in the area? Oh, a Kangaskhan! Oh. I didn't even notice you! Beautiful, beautiful specimen right there. Why am I stopping? Is there something I'm supposed to be capturing over here? I have not found the Crystal Bloom. Ah, it's you! Nice! Nice, 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 nice. Ooh. Where was that earthquake from? A Minior! And a Sandshrew! Minior? Minior, please look at me. Min no! No! Why do you keep zooming out of frame, Minior? I hate you both. Wait. I feel like there's a big Pokemon in the area and I just don't know where to look. Oh. Oh, hi. More photos. Oh! Oh well. Let's see this one through to the end. Damn it! Ice cream! Oh, there are more mini yours in play. Fluff fruit! Fluff fruit! Oh, that's unfortunate. Wait, what are you? Ah, there was a Skaroopy under the Onyx? That's strange. And a bunch of mini -ors. I'm not gonna lie, mini are one of my favorite, like, flying types. Rock flying types. They're just so adorable. And the whole ability thing really works. Alright, time to go back then. I accept my fate. Hocha! Hello? Professor? Welcome back. Thank you. Yep. Nine Pokemon in store, Professor. Time to do this. Right, we're ready. Let's show Professor what we've got. Evaluation of Sans Knight. Now then. Scorpy. Mm. I did not get the whatever the hell Kamehameha blast that was. Great but timing. <laughs> great timing. Just a rock falls, crushes a Skorupi, get a picture. Awesome timing, awesome picture of death and destruction. Oh, it's, it's not even bronze. See, that's our first silver picture of Skorupi. Why is it that all photos that we have of Skorupi are it in pain? Like, does the professor have something against Skorupi? I feel like it's been bullied way too much. A new discovery. A new discovery. Trap inch, really cute. Three star photo. It's looking hey, right our way. I mean, the eyes are on the side of its head, but you know, it's something. Yes. Gold. I'll take it. Golds are fine. Cacnea. Two star photo. Nice them work. enjoying the fluff fruit. Them stopping to look at the fluff fruit. Not the good best picture, but it's two stars, you know. Lycan Rock. I chose this one. Because of the light in the eye. It's just so Perfect cool. Time. Fascinating behavior, I agree. Yes? And you did not give me diamond. Okay, fine. Fascinating, but not fascinating enough, apparently. Mm. Mandibuzz. This is a solid Hi. Mandibuzz photo. Give me diamond. Come on, professor. Flying type expert. 
There we go. There we go. Double diamonds. Kangaskhan. I should get background points for this. It's cute. Great timing. Yes. You know what just sunk in, guys? I realized that I analyzed the Illumina crystal bloom flower thing, but I didn't take a picture of it. Oh well, I'll just do that off camera again. It's fine. Minior. It was turned around. Nice work. Ah, not not a good photo. That's that's a shame for my flying type portfolio. Shan Shantru. Sandshrew, really good, really big. You can see it's big doughy eyes, even though it's a side profile. But Professor's side profiles, they're really in. It's Instagrammable. <laughs> yes, yes, Diamond, thank you. Exactly. Onyx, I feel bad for this photo because he's like, Oh, what? Ice cream? Where's the ice cream? Nice work. Come on. Give it to me. Yes. Diamond. Double diamond onyx photo. Awesome. So, you know, for this run, I think we've had pretty solid photos for the desert. I doubt that there's even going to be an Illumina appearance this episode. Oh, we went straight to level 2 with that one. Look at that, you've hit a new stage in your research. Keep an eye out for changes, no matter how small. We got that in one take! Registered 50 species. A beginner photographer with the pride colors. Happy Pride Month! Sparkles too. Nice. Ground-type Pokemon. And the Oasis! Awesome, awesome. Well, I'm gonna leave it all here. If you enjoyed this episode, again, leave a like, comment, share, subscribe. Really helps out the channel. It would be much appreciated. And yeah, keep having fun. I'll see you guys in the next episode, whenever that is. Until then, bye bye. See ya.